What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome back to my subscribers. And welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash this up button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading. Caps to decide to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. Doesn't apply to the fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. I got several channeled in, so I'm going to deliver them um, in separate readings like I normally do. Thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. You guys are just the bestest. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess Tarot 5. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only. No cash out, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate. I do not publicly display how much you donate or your name for privacy and confidentiality purposes. Single mom with two kids, so it truly, truly, truly helps. Just saying. Um, love you guys. Okay, so the channel message I received was... Um, a Libra that received a very, very, very large um, amount of money from a Secret 7 uh, gag order court situation is about to have to pay it all back. They are about to be severely pissed um, through many series of chain of events. This is going to occur. Um, that's what I heard. So you plug it in, how it resonates, if that resonates uh, from you, uh, from you, for you, just saying. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. A Taurus was in heavy cahoots with her, but that is being exposed. Oh, okay. So you plug it in how it resonates. So, Libra and energy, Libra and energy. Um, they could have Libra in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or they've been in their Jupiter charts. But I heard Secret 7 gag order um, court situation. It sounds like it's already wrapped up. How that resonates. And um, I heard a Taurus was in heavy cahoots with this Libra. So it could be a masculine or fifth Libra. They could have Libra in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, and behavior, Jupiter charts. But apparently they received a very, very, very large amount of money from this Secret 7 um gag order court situation whoever this sleeper is in the universe you have to plug this sleeper in however it resonates in your own life um i'm thinking it might be the core member i mean i think it's older sister libra is what i'm thinking but but it doesn't have to be it could be any libra that was involved in the secret seven situation and i'm serious it really could be any libra there were a ton of libras involved in the secret seven situation I mean, because there was so many people involved in it. So it doesn't have to be. I didn't hear it was. I mean, it could it could be any Libra that was involved. Any Libra. Um, and I'm just serious. They could have Libra in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or them in here with Jupiter charts. But I heard I, Taurus was in cahoots with this Libra. Um, so they were in cahoots. Meaning they worked together with this Libra so they could um, get the money. So they could get the money. They, I, I don't know if the Taurus was a judge. I don't know if they were a person that litigated against this person and knew they were going to lose. I don't know if they were a lawyer. I didn't hear specifically how this Taurus was connected in. They have Taurus in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Thumb, and Hammer, Jupiter charts. I'll tell you that. So, um, you plug it in however it resonates. But I heard this Taurus, I mean, not this Taurus, this Libra, is about to have to pay the money all back. Um, they're going to be very, very, very pissed. And they are going to have heavy le negative legal issues in the justice system. And they're going to have negative uh, legal, heavy legal issues in the justice system. So they're about to have to pay all this money back and they're about to have negative legal issues in the justice system. So I'm thinking, uh, well, one, they'll have to pay it back. Two, they might get fined. Uh, three, they might wind up in jail and then awaiting maybe a prison sentence. Because um, that, you know, that is doing the most. That's doing the most. Whoever this Taurus is, I wonder if the Taurus went against this Libra strategically for um, for the gag order. I mean, I wonder if they planned it all. Or if the Taurus was the lawyer or the Taurus was a judge. I feel it can go any of those ways. But you plug it in how it resonates. Um, however that resonates. Another judge has gotten wind of this. And they are about to clean house. Another judge. And someone else. Very high. 
High vibing. Another, okay, I heard another judge and someone else very high vibing is getting wind of this so getting wind of this situation um and they're about to clean house so uh, i think they're about to um they're about to bring this uh low vibrational libra to justice this is exactly what i'm thinking here um i heard they have to pay the money back and other negative legal issues so i'm thinking fines possibly or jail um maybe jail no bail um or jail with a hell of a lot of bail or um or something of that nature i mean you plug it in how it resonates something like that is what i'm presuming you plug it in how it resonates spirit messages you have to play here second chakra archangel ariel Appreciation. So we have sacral chakra and appreciation. Man holding a coin reverse. Number 36, 15, or 43 could be very significant numbers in one's life. 36, 15, or 43. These could be possible ages of you or somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible jersey number, possible green card number, 36, 15, or 43. A very low vibrational judge is about to be in serious, serious, serious trouble. Serious. Soon and quickly. Another judge is truly not playing around. Okay, I heard another judge is about to be... Uh, in serious, serious, serious trouble very soon and very quickly. The other judge is not playing around. So maybe you're the other judge, judge. I, um, whoever you are, you're very significant in this. We have two judges, uh, one very low vibrational judge. Maybe it's the Taurus. Maybe it's not. I'm not sure. Um, you have to plug it in how it resonates. Uh, but whoever you are, other judge, you're very high vibrational. This, The one that basically, work, um, I think they work together with, this other judge is significant in this too, but they're low vibrational. So I think they work together with this Libra to get the money. Um, I think that's exactly what I think happened. It's kind of like in the summertime of 2021 when I was pulling in the Secret 7 situation about the doppelganger going into the court of law and um, uh, doppelganger single mom Leo and basically stole money. Basically stole money because the doppelganger looked a lot like single mom Leo, basically. Um, but that's what it reminds me of. But um, I didn't hear a doppelganger in here, but um, that's what it reminds me of. Someone's getting a huge wake-up call. Okay, I heard someone's getting a huge wake-up call. I mean, I'm serious. That That is exactly what it reminds me of. That was like in the summer of 2021 um, when that happened. Um, so maybe it was the same judge. May, um, if we're talking, oh, well, we are talking Secret 7. I heard Secret 7. Maybe the same judge. Um, but I heard they're about to be in a lot of trouble very soon, very quickly. They're, you, other judge, high vibrational judge over here, you are um, either have just learned of this or you're about to learn of it, um, and you're about to take great action against this other judge. So um, I think you might get them debarred. Uh, I don't know how, is it disbarred? Disbarred? I don't know the process of um, judges stepping down um, because of, low ethics and morals and et cetera, et cetera. I know it happens, but I don't know the actual term of that. I wonder if that's what's going to happen, um, if they're going to have to step down or they're going to get demoted or they lose their seat um, on the judge's bench or what have you. I mean, I don't know. Um, I'm sure you know how my personal judge, but I do not know. So you plug it in how it resonates, but you're about to take great... As great negative action against this judge. So you're about to create negative series of chain of events for this judge, whatever it is, um, and however it resonates. Heard you're about to clean house. So you have a vibrational judge. You're about to do the right thing. You're about to do the right thing. Ethics, morals, values, integrity, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, whoever you are. Um, but this other judge over here just likes to 
apparently give um, large amounts of money away to people that don't deserve it. I'll tell you that. It's really sad. Men holding a coin reverse. It's about to cause huge money loss for this judge and loss of other things. And, and once this occurs, other people are going to come forward about the past of this very low, low vibrational judge. Oh my God. Whoa. Okay. So this low vibrational judge is very significant in here too. You might be the low vibrational judge for all I know. You might be the high vibrational judge. We've got two polar opposite judge energies here, but um, I heard once this occurs, high vibrational judge, you start creating these negative series of chain events for the low vibrational judge. Um, other, many other people are going to come forward about, I guess, these low vibrational activities of this judge. Um, I'm feeling, obviously, they are very heavily connected with members out in the community. I, I, I'm feeling, I didn't hear it, but I wonder if it's like prostitution, like if they are they're into something that involves sneaky link energy with the community, but in a negative sense, in a negative sneaky link sense, if that makes sense, um, and heavily involved. So um, it is about to backfire on them in a huge way. Okay, I heard it's about to backfire on them in a huge way. So it's about to backfire on this um, love original judge. There's some kind of sneaky link energy they have out in the community. But it's about to backfire on them in a huge way. Um, I heard it's going to cause huge money loss for this low vibrational judge. It might be a masculine energy judge or a femme that takes on heavy masculine energy. Um, and I heard other people, once this other high vibrational judge starts doing what they're going to do, I think they might report them. Um, or maybe they have the power to disbar them. I mean, I don't know. Um, only you know this high vibrational judge. But um, only you know your story, not anybody else. And I definitely am not familiar with those kind of processes. I'm just not. But um, it's going to cause huge money loss and other um, negative series of chain events for this judge. I feel for some it could be a masculine judge or a bin that takes on heavy masculine energy. And an Aquarius is about to negatively be in for it. Loss of career. Holy crap. And an Aquarius is about to be in for it. Loss of career. So money loss all over the place for an Aquarius. Now, I didn't hear what specific occupation this Aquarius is. Um, they have Aquarius in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, mid, hammer, Jupiter charts. But they, are in, they connect with this high vibrational judge, this low vibrational judge. And um, they might work in the legal sector. Um, I feel they know these people, so I think they work in the legal sector or they are connected to the judges in some shape, form, or fashion, but somehow they um, are connected in the situation, Aquarian energy. Um, I heard they are about to um, lose their career. They're about to, I mean, lose their career, so not wrongful termination energy. I mean, they're about, they're about to lose their career for reasons here. Um so that's money loss too. It could be a masculine uh, Aquarius or a fin that takes on heavy masculine energy. Money loss. Oh, crap, man. This is huge. Second chakra, Archangel Ariel. Uh, sacral chakra. I mean, not sacral. Sorry, not sexual sacral. It's um, solar plexus. Color is yellow. Solar plexus chakra. There's about to be huge tower moments here. This high vibrational judge is going to get lots of high honor for this. And another feminine energy that should have been high in high honor in the past, a long time ago.
Oh, wow, this is beautiful. Holy moly. Um, I heard um, uh, you have a racial judge, so you're going to get high honor for this, I heard. You're going to get high honor for exposing um, this nasty low vibrational judge, this Libra that basically duped. Um, they're very smart. This Libra is very smart, I'll tell you that. There's a reason they went and did this gag order. There's a reason they did the gag order. Um, and it's so people wouldn't discuss it out in the community. But the community knows this Libra has been giving money away left and right. Left and right. Know this. To drug addicts. And prostitutes and former prostitutes. Oh my God. Whoa, this is sick. Okay. So I heard, but the community knows. So the Libra and this low vibrational judge or other people, maybe the lawyers or whoever, um, did the gag order for a specific reason. So the community couldn't talk about it, basically. So the community couldn't talk about it, couldn't discuss it, um, uh, because they knew what they were doing and they knew what they were doing was wrong. And they probably did it to get the judge that they wanted, because there's a reason this judge is very significant. They probably went in there to get this specific judge to make it go exactly the way they wanted it to go. Um, that's what I'm thinking here. Um, but however that resonates, um, uh, I heard the community, know, the community knows. The community knows because I heard the Libra has been giving out money to members of this community. So they've been, they've been publicly, oh yeah, I'm, I'm rich. And people know this Libra's rich, but they know they're rich off of money they shouldn't have, basically, um, regarding the Secret 7 situation. And they're giving away money, I heard, to drug users, um, prostitutes, and former prostitutes. So they're just, I mean, they have so much money because they're so rich off this. I, I, whatever amount of money they got, it was a large-ass amount of money, I can tell you that. But they're giving it away to people who basically don't deserve it when they could be investing it. Um, or giving it to people that really deserve it or giving it to charities or um, doing very positive community action type things in the universe. They're giving it away to prostitutes, former prostitutes and drug users. Um, that doesn't make any sense to me. If you really truly cared about the drug users and the prostitutes and former prostitutes, why don't you create a shelter for um, a, or an addiction? Why don't you um, set up an addiction center? Why don't you... Um, uh, do a housing, uh, temporary housing situation for uh, people to get on their feet so they don't have to prostitute. I mean, it sounds like a sneaky leak energy too in the community with this um, Libra. But it's selective. This Libra is very, very smart. It's selective people they want to give it to. Um, it's like controlling energy because they have a very, very, very large amount of money. But it's low vibrational people they're interacting with. Um, yikes, but I heard you're going to get lots of high honor, high, uh, high vibrational judge. You are in a particular feminine energy that should have gotten, um, um, high honor in the past, but they did not. The feminine energy did not. And it sounds like probably public high honor. Um, this is going to be very, very, very public, very public. Okay. I heard this is going to be very, very public, very public. So it's going to be very public. Um, so I, maybe you're going to make it public. Uh, I think you're going to make it public, um, judge, have a original judge. But it sounds like, in my opinion, of course, I'm not one of the ones that rules the world um, or has control like that in the world. But if I did, I would make it public too because to show people that this kind of shit is not okay because the Secret 7 situation should have never, ever, ever happened. Never. If people really want to get off their feet get on their feet and they want to quit prostituting they want to quit using drugs they will do it they will do it it won't be easy but they will do it and it's the truth um and i'm not talking badly about drug users or um prostitutes but what i'm saying is and that can go for anybody if anybody wants to change their life it, yes it will be hard but it can be done i'm living proof of that i'm living freaking proof of that and that's just the truth if you really, really, really want to change your life, you can do it. It's going to be hard, but you can do it. You can do it, in the words of Rob Schneider. And I'm serious. Um, but I heard basically, uh, 
you're gonna it's gonna go very public so you and this fifth energy is going to get high honor for this um congrats to you have a high vibrational judge appreciation You are going to be very, 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 very publicly recognized, high vibrational judge, by other judges, high vibrational judges. And one stellar committee for doing this. This will definitely go down in the history books in your city, and it will go way more public than that. Oh my God, wow, holy shit. I'm just gonna go down in the history books in your city, high vibrational judge. That is saying something. And you're going to be publicly recognized by other high vibrational judges and a very particular committee or board or what have you. I think maybe other judges. Um, oh, I wonder if it's like Supreme Court energy. Um, I wonder if a Supreme Court energy is gonna recognize, your, recognize you. Um, I didn't hear it was. But it might be. I mean, you are about to blow it open, high vibrational judge. You're about to blow it open in a very positive way. But it's going to give you high honor by all these other high vibrational judges, I think, out in the universe and other states or countries or areas or what have you, because they're going to hear about it. Um, because it's going to be so huge. It's going to be huge. I mean, it's going to go down the history books in your city. So that's extremely huge. And you're about to change the game and the energy shifts in a positive way. But you're about to use your power and not an abuse of power kind of way like this low vibrational judge has. You're about to use it in a positive way. Wow, holy crap, I like you, high vibrational judge. I like you, I like you a lot. Holy crap, you're amazing. Appreciation, so you're about to get appreciated by these other judges. Now, of course, after all this occurs, after all this occurs, whoever you are, um, you're, you're going to get appreciated. You're going to get honored. You're going to get recognized by these other judges um, and some kind of important board or committee. I wonder if the Supreme Court is, because um, this is huge. This is freaking huge. I wonder if they are going to recognize you. I didn't hear they were, but they may. If it's not Supreme Court energy, it may, I mean, it's definitely other high vibrational judges are definitely going to take their hats off to you because what you're about to do is huge. It is about to be huge, huge. It is about to be huge, I heard. Huge! Huge! You are my kind of person. This is positive, game-changing energy. Oh, my God. I heard it's going to be huge. Um, And you're going to appreciate this fame energy that did not get higher in the past. So, whoever you are, how about Rachel Judge, I just, my hat's off to you. You are the bomb. You are. You're the bomb. I'm just saying. You're the bomb. Bomb.com. Uh, but, you are going to appreciate this femme energy that did not and appreciate and recognize and or you may not you may or you may not appreciate recognize and etc cetera, etc cetera, this femme energy this femme energy that did not get higher in the past is very significant to you so you may maybe she um is in a court situation with you possibly or maybe she's not if she is you might recognize her honor her or give her some kind of positive judgment possibly if she's connected in a court case with you, if she's not, you may just recognize her in some shape, form, or fashion um, in a positive sense. I heard it's going to be very public, so um, you might just recognize her. Um, some kind of public setting, some kind of public gala, some kind of public recognizing, um, like um, public... Um, recognition in some shape form or fashion um appreciation but you that's you to this fem energy right you paying it forward to this fem energy you doing the right thing morals ethics values etc 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 right but after all this occurs you are going to get appreciated from all these other high vibrational judges their hats are going to come off to you because you're doing the right thing i mean you're about to shake it up in your city in a very positive way and i'm just being for real about that you're about to shake it up in your city in a positive way. Um, it sounds like it needs to, it sounds like it should have been shook a long fucking time ago. And excuse my French, but I'm serious. It should, it sounds like none of the secret seven situations should ever happen. 
And I'm serious about that. It should have never, ever, ever happened. It just shouldn't have. Um, so you're about to shake it up in a positive way. This, which is going to create this, I think, after all these judges hear about it. They're going to publicly appreciate you, recognize you, honor you. I wonder if somebody in the Supreme Court uh, may nominate you, possibly. I didn't hear any of that. I didn't. I, I did not hear that by a racial judge. I didn't hear you're going to be nominated for Supreme Court or any, anything like that. But I wonder because I mean it's not just one high vibrational judge about to do this. It's going to be many that's going to. They're basically going to be down on looking on you in honor and respect and. Um, they're going to be looking up to you because you are about to shake things up in huge ways. You are the best, man. You are the bomb. Oh, my God. God, let me see if I hear anything else. I don't like this judge, but I like you. I mean, because you, sounds like you take your position seriously. Sounds like you take your position seriously and you, um, you, it's like you you took your oath seriously. It's like you take your oath seriously, and you truly do want to do the right thing, and you um, take your job description seriously, and so much so you're about to go against this other judge. But I don't blame you. I went, you know, I'm a nurse. For anybody doesn't know, I'm a nurse. I've been a nurse a long time, and I went against other nurses in the past. I have, um, and trust me, just because you trust me, there's things that happen out there. Where you have to stand up for yourself. You have to stand up for your situation. You have to stand up. You have to stand up. Period. I mean, I can tell you from healthcare, but this is in the legal sector, but period. It's, uh, there's situations you have to stand up for. I've done that before. And uh, my work sector is what I'm trying to say, high vibrational judge. I have done that. Um, I've gotten flat for it before in the past. I've gotten flat for it. People didn't like it. Um, but it's because I couldn't, um, do what they were doing, um, basically. But, um, or they couldn't talk to me the way they wanted to talk to me, which was treat me like a piece of crap. You know what I'm saying? Um, uh, now I didn't go off like yelling at them or screaming or acting cray cray. But my point is, is you take your job seriously. I like, I take my job seriously. You take your job seriously. And, um, I respect that is what I'm trying to say. I respect somebody that takes their job seriously, that does not abuse their power and their authority. They truly, truly do uh, hone and utilize their um, authority seat. And this is a very high authority seat, a judge is, in a positive manner is what I'm trying to say. All right, let me see if I hear anything else. Okay, I didn't. Oh my God, this was a great reading. Wow. Holy crap. This was wonderful. Kudos to you. You're about to shake things up. It's about to start going very, very, very fast. Very fast. It's about to start going very, very, very fast. Very fast. So um, I think this situation is about to start going very fast. Um, how this resonates in your life. I'm a racial judge. You're dealing with a low racial Libra, a low racial judge a Taurus, and an Aquarius. Um, however this plugs in in one's life and situation, I think for, for, feel for some of these situations, a Taurus might be this low vibrational judge, possibly, or a lawyer. The Aquarius is somehow connected into you judges and this low vibrational Libra. Um, and you've got this low vibrational Libra just giving out money to ex-prostitutes, current prostitutes, and drug users. Let them go, if they really want to help themselves, let them go get resources out in the community to help themselves, not give them away money. Oh, I'm rich now, I'm rich, I'm rich. I duped the system. Let me give you a bunch of money. Um, Take your clothes off for me. I'll give you 500. What? No, and I didn't I didn't hear any of that, but I'm, I'm, that's the kind of energy I'm feeling over here. Nay, nay. All right, I love you guys. Everybody have a wonderful day and namaste.